Hey. <laughs> Before anyone wants to like do an expose on me about cancer, I never had brain cancer. I never had, as far as I know, I had never had any form of cancer. <laughs> but I do believe that ayahuasca, I mean, uh, DMT will cure, it, it, it will cure all your diseases. I know that for a fact. I had the worst form of cancer. Atheism and DMT cured that. So now anyone who wants to write an article, Kevin, if that's your like your angle, hey, he's a fraud. Now I told you, you gotta filter everything through the, the prism of getting people's attention. Because now that I have your attention, do DMT. If you, and you have to do it to the level where you don't have any doubts. If you have any doubts about what DMT is all about, you have not done enough. No, I never had cancer. Just put it all over the internet, I don't give a fuck. Every scan I ever had was clean as a whistle because I'm healthy as a horse. But I needed to get your attention. <laughs> trust me on this. Trust me on this. I know. Why would we trust him? Because he lied about cancer. That's right. Except that I didn't lie about cancer. I'm telling you the truth about that I had the worst form of cancer. That's called atheism. And DMT cured that. You guys, you just don't get it. I'm trying to get your attention when I'm mean to people. I say mad, bad things about them that I don't really mean. I'm trying to get your attention, focus your attention. And I'm gonna die someday, right? Who cares about me if I get hit by a truck? Who cares about me? DMT is more important than I am. Because when I die, I'm gonna now be out there helping you as, messed up, as best I can from the spirit world. Like I know it exists and I'm gonna be there. It's not about me, it's about DMT. I've told my friends from the beginning, it's about DMT, now get it and do it. Stop, stop stopping, stop stopping. Go as quickly as you can and get a hold of DMT and inhale it. And inhale it until you, you'll see. When you inhale the right amount, you will never have another doubt in your life. I don't doubt anything. I think, I, I think I'm coming across as fairly confident. Now, how could I possibly have no doubt? Trust me, you do the right amount of DMT and you're not gonna have any doubt. You're not gonna be Joe Rogan on the Joe Rogan Show asking questions. Hey, I wonder if DMT is a portal to another dimension. Obviously it is. Obviously, there's no doubt. Stop asking stupid questions. Now, I'm, now again, I never had cancer. I never had, had organic, I never had cellular cancer. I had, I had a worse form of cancer, that cancer of atheism. Good, spread it around Reddit, because it's just gonna get me more attention. I want attention, not on me, on DMT. Because it allows you to see, not only, you can see everything, and, but you can see the aliens now. If you don't wanna do it, fuck off. You wanna call me a liar, fuck off, it doesn't matter. Go fuck yourself. In fact, get people here who don't like to say me, have me say, go fuck yourself, so I can say, go fuck yourself. Do DMT and it's all gonna make sense. And these idiots who do a little, well, I did a little, I did DMT and it doesn't do any sense. Do, you trust me, do enough so that you'll know, you will know. Chris Cantelmo here, and I'm not gonna go away, I'm gonna keep saying this. And I'm gonna be the most famous person in the history of humanity. Okay, you wanna call me Jesus Christ? I'm not Jesus Christ, I'm Chris Cantelmo. Is, there, is Jesus gonna come back in the second coming? I don't know, you'll have to ask Jesus. But I can tell you this, the king has arrived. Chris Cantelmo, humanity's king has arrived and it's me. And it could have been any one of you if you just had done this and then spoken up and not been afraid. Don't be afraid. The king, your king is here and it's me. And if you don't like me, it doesn't matter. And lucky for you, I'm a benevolent king. I'm gonna give you what you want, which is your freedom. If you just listen to me, trust me, you will get your freedom.